Thank you for subbing. It's thumbs up. What's up guys and welcome to Foxtail Outdoors. My name is Jeff. In today's video, I'm going to be comparing the stock extra extra full Accu Choke from the Mossberg 500 to the Carlson brand Longbeard XR Turkey Choke Tube. I've never ran this uh, particular choke in any weapon before and it's actually designed for the Winchester Longbeard XRs. For today's video, I'm going to be shooting number five shot, three inch three inch shells because that's all this particular gun can handle um, typically I would shoot a six shot but I've struggled with turkey season being so far away here in uh, southern Indiana most places aren't carrying turkey hunting equipment gear stuff like that just yet so I had to go with what I found and that was a five shot so for starters I'm gonna be shooting from the uh, extra extra full choke I'm gonna be shooting at 30 yards and we'll do a side-by-side -side comparison from the Accu Choke to the Carlson brand. So let's get it started. All right, so again, I'm starting with the Accu Choke, the extra, extra full, 0 .670, shooting at 30 yards. Looks like I may have pulled just a hair right, but pretty good, pretty good pattern at 30 yards. Let's take a look. So that definitely could have been more of me. Obviously, it's a dead turkey. Um, this this gun has not been shot since last turkey season. Okay, so right here, that is a Carlson brand choke tube first ever shot with it so we'll see how it does at 30 yards compared to the standard the factory uh, choke tube made by Mossberg oh yeah okay so that first shot with that Carlson's it is a much, much tighter group. Wow. That's incredible. Let me, show, let me show this to you guys. This is just incredible. Okay, so this is the shot at 30 yards with the Carlson choke tube. As you can see, dozens and dozens of pellets in that kill zone of that turkey. Very, very good target. Look at the difference. So you see how tight these shots are together. Again, this is the Carlson's. Compare that to the standard Accu Choke. Big difference. Obviously, I did pull when I shot on the uh, Accu Choke, but the shot on the Carlson was dead money. They're both kill shots, both dead birds. So, for this next shot, I decided rather than shooting at 40 and 50 and killing my, my shoulder by taking half dozen shots. I ended up moving it out to 50 yards. 50 yards is a good poke with a turkey gun. Obviously, I, I believe that both of these chokes will, they will perform. So last year, I ended up killing two birds at pretty good range. One was around 50 yards, and the other was at 62. And that's with this stock, you know, standard Mossberg factory choke. So I definitely believe that the, I definitely believe that the Carlson will continue to outperform the Accu choke. Let's just see how big of a difference it is. Going from 30 yards to 50 yards, it's a really, really big difference when shooting at a turkey. Just to give you an idea of how far this shot is. You can't even see the target. All right, guys, so this next shot's going to be at 50 yards. It's a really good shot. It's a long shot, I should say. And I'm going to be starting with the Carlson brand this time, following it up with the Accu Choke. So let's see the difference.
definitely a dead bird. Can't really tell how tight the pattern is from here. So give me just a second, I'll show you that target. All right, folks, so I counted 26 pellets in the kill area. That's, that's just on paper, 26 pellets at 50 yards, several up in the head. So if we count just the head and neck area, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 of those 24 were in the head and neck area. Dead bird, 50 yards. So sorry if it's a little uh, windy on camera, it's quite breezy today. Uh, the second shot at 50 yards will be with the AccuChoke, the factory choke tube. Same shell, same everything else. So 50 yards, I, I know that it's going to perform, but how well will it perform compared to the Carlson's? Let's see. Shot number four, trying to break my shoulder off. At first glance, it actually looks like a tighter group at 50 yards with the Accu choke. We'll see though. Okay, so with the Mossberg factory choke tube, we actually had more pellets on target in the kill area. We had 28 compared to the 24 that the Carlson's had. However, the biggest difference is in the head and neck area. So let's say from here up, from here up, kind of, yeah, the head and neck area, there's only 11. So 11 out of the 28 uh, pellets were in the head and neck area. Whereas with the Carlson's, 15 of the 24 were in that head and neck area. Definitely another dead bird. Surprised. <laughs> That's a very surprising result. So more shots on target, less in the head and neck area though. Okay, so for the third and final test, comparing the factory choke tube versus the Carlson's, 60 yards we're going to be shooting right at 60 yards it's a very very long shot i don't recommend that most people take shots like this at real life living turkeys unless you know your gun and you're very comfortable with your gun you should not be taking shots like this at birds your goal should be to call the birds in close you know 20 30 yards that's the sweet spot it's really hard to miss at 30 yards 20 yards it's actually easier to miss than 30 yards simply because you're shooting a tighter group but I, I really shoot a lot of my birds at 30 or 40 yards because I get a really hairy uh, trigger finger. And that's one of my goals for the 2020 season is to allow the birds to get in close. If I'm using decoys, I want to allow those birds to get in close to the decoys. That way it gives me some good film, you know, great footage to show you guys in the upcoming season. With that being said, I'm also doing a giveaway on this channel. As soon as we hit 500 subscribers, I'm giving away three AVNX decoys. They're very lightly used. A lookout hen, a feeder hen, and a three-quarter strut Jake decoy. A couple hundred dollars worth of decoys I'm giving away to a subscriber. So make sure you check out that subscriber giveaway video. Um, like it, subscribe to the channel, comment on that video, and you'll be entered to win. So good luck to everybody who enrolls into that giveaway. All right, folks, so this is the final shot with the Accu Choke, 60 yards. It looks like another dead turkey. I'll show you in just a second. Okay, so it looks like we had 22. Uh, shots on target of that in the head and neck area one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven pretty good like I said I killed a bird at 62 yards last year with the same choke definitely a dead turkey I really hope that this Carlson can keep up with the Accu choke we will see. 
All right, so this is the final shot of the test. I'm gonna take one more shot with the uh, Carlson brand. I'm gonna do that at 20 yards after this. But this is the final shot of the test, 60 yards with the Carlson choke tube. I think I may have pulled just a hair left. Don't know. We'll see. Show you guys in just a second. All right, so the Carlson did pretty good at 60. We had 17 shots on target, and of those 17, eight were in the head and neck area. It's not great. Like I said, I did pull just a hair. I wasn't 100% positive if I did or not. So, comparing the Carlson brand choke tube to the accu choke that comes standard in the Mossberg 500 tactical turkey I don't think that you need to have a different aftermarket choke $55 for that Carlson brand choke tube yes it's slightly better at 30 yards my first shot it was really good you know it, it clearly outperformed the uh, accu choke at, at 30 yards but at ranges of 50 and 60 yards, they're almost identical in, in many ways. The AccuChook may have outperformed the Carlson in this test. If not, they're very close. If you don't have the money to be, you know, upgrading your chokes, don't. If you have the AccuChook on your Mossberg, just stick with it. You can kill birds out to 60 yards. I, I wouldn't say do it consistently, but... You, you definitely can kill birds at 60 yards and anything within 60 yards, as long as you don't pull or shoot a bunch of brush in front of you, you're going to be hammering birds every single time. So I hate to say it, but you know, this was actually money not well spent. I, I'm still happy that I have the product. You know, I'm trying something new, something new for my turkey gun. And yeah, I mean, it's 55 bucks to shoot very similar to the choke that I already had. So like I said, I'm going to take one more shot. We got this target at 20 yards. I'll give you a target view. That way you don't have to look at my ugly face. 20 yards. Let's see how good this Carlson brand choke tube shoots. <laughs> 